in Philippians 3, Paul says that uh, I forget the things behind and I press forward to the things that are ahead. That's sort of my paraphrase. But I thought about that and I was thinking about, you know, I, I have my stuff. Yeah, you do too. And one of the things, I, I just bought a pickup truck. I love it. It's a great truck. I'm blessed because of it. It's missing the cap on the lug nuts on one wheel, just one wheel. Three of them do. One doesn't. Drives me crazy. I ordered one so I'd have it. Is that OCD? Well, I don't want to get into that, but I have my stuff. I have my things, and I I want to practice what Paul says, forgetting the things and moving on forward. I, but you know what? It's not always easy, is it? We have these things. My wife says, if I get something stuck in my head, I, it's there, and I won't let go until it's finished, completed, whatever. And that's not what I want to be doing. I mean, I want to be doing that with God, with Christ, with the things of him. But I don't want to do other things. But I do, just like everybody else. And so, I mean, I was going to lay down and take a nap. And I got thinking about this, and I, I couldn't let it go. And I said, I got to get up and take a video. So here I am. So what's the one thing that you struggle with that keeps you from moving forward to going on into the next thing that God has for you. What keeps you stuck in that place? What won't you leave behind? Paul says, let's leave it behind and move forward into the things that he has for us. I want you to think about that today, would you? Hey, until next time, God bless.